while I have you, I think it's only uh, fair we should talk about Obamacare, and that rhymed. Well, <laughs> you know, we've got about two weeks left till March 31st for people to sign up. If you don't have health insurance right now, you should go on healthcare.gov, and especially all the moms out there who may have young people, 26, 27, don't have health insurance, but they think they're invincible and nothing's ever going to happen to them. You know, what, what we've said is you never know what life is going to throw at you. You can, at this point, get health insurance for uh, $100 a, a month or less, uh, in some cases less than your cell phone bill or your uh, cable bill, and it gives you some financial security. It gives moms some mental security that uh, uh, their, their kids are going to have decent care. And, you know, particularly at this moment when uh, a lot of young people, as they come out and they're getting their first or second jobs, they don't necessarily get a bef uh, benefit on the job. Now's the time to take a look at it. But uh, the website is now working. Healthcare.gov actually uh, works the way it's supposed to. And, uh, and I, I hope that people take advantage because if you don't sign up before March 31st, then you won't be able to sign up again until November. And I want to make sure that everybody has this opportunity now. It's doing very, very well. I think it's surprised. Uh, it, it, it had a rough start, but you've got 5 million people that have signed up so far, which is a, an enormous amount of people that have signed up. So it's successful. And why, why is there a deadline? Why is there not a, just an open-ended where, because I think it is important for everyone to have health care. And a lot of people think, oh, I'll be fine. And like you said, you never know what's going to happen. Well, if anybody who's gotten uh, health insurance on the job, you know, you have this thing called an open enrollment period. Basically, the insurers, they're pricing for a year, and then they need to figure out how many people have signed up, what the risk pool looks like, how many elderly people are, how many healthy people, how many young people, and that's how they set prices for the following year. So uh, they have to close the open enrollment period at the end of March 31st. They'll start back up so you can sign back up in 2015 in November. But if you don't have health insurance right now, now's the time uh, to check it out. And as I said, uh, you know, people will be pleasantly surprised. I, I've got a lot of folks who write me letters saying, I didn't vote for you, and I'm pretty skeptical about Obamacare, and I heard about all the problems on the website. But when I actually signed up, uh, it turns out that I'm saving 100 bucks, 200 bucks, or I'm getting health insurance for the first time. And so all I'm encouraging everybody to do is to take a look and see what options are right uh, for you and your family. And moms out there, email your kids if they don't have health insurance and tell them to at least check it out because they may be pleasantly surprised that it's uh, much more affordable than people thought. Well, people are starting to applaud here. I think that you, everyone's very grateful that you did this. And I think it is important for people to sign up and to... To, uh, it's just better to be covered. You just never know. And before we go, first of all, I appreciate your time, and I know you're busy, and it's the end of the day, and you've got to walk the dogs and do the laundry. But <laughs> before we go, I have. Uh, do you do you watch House of Cards? Do you watch Scandal? What are your thoughts on those shows? You know, I watch House of Cards. I haven't seen Scandal yet, but Michelle has watched uh, Scandal. I have to tell you, life in Washington is a little more boring than displayed on the screen. <laughs> I hope so. Uh, yeah, yeah. That, uh, you know, the truth of the matter is, most of the, if you followed me, most of my day is sitting in a room uh, listening to a bunch of uh, folks in gray suits uh, talking about a whole bunch of stuff that uh, wouldn't make very good television. No. Well, that's, that's yeah. what I do, and we make great television. That's what... That's, I, I, have to, I have to tell you, though, Ellen, uh, there is not much dancing in the Situation Room, no. as a general rule. That's no. what's missing. That's what you have to do. Let's... That's the problem. All right. It, what, what about that Let's Move campaign? Make people dance in there. <laughs> All right. Listen, thank you so much. Uh, you should watch Scandal. It's really, really good. And I'm, I'm glad to hear That's that... That's what Michelle tells me. It is. It's great. And uh, I'm going to call Michelle and give her a good report. I'll tell her you're, uh, you're doing okay. You can go to our Thank website you. to learn more about Obamacare. Remember that March 31st is the deadline to enroll, and uh, we'll be back. Mr. President, thank you so much. Always good talking to you. Great to talk to you again. Thanks, Ellen.